Okay, hello again. I wanted to talk today about preparation. Preparation for 2011. Now we're at the end of October, we're just coming up to Halloween, so there's, there are some things that you'll need to do just to prepare in your mind for the coming year. And by the time we get to December, you're going to be wanting to set some goals and objectives for next year. And now's the time to start thinking about that process and start to prioritise what it is you're, you're focusing on. It may be your goal is just to stay at the level that you are for 2011. We're in some challenging economic times and just staying where you are might be your objective. And that's fine. That's, that's what you're aiming to do. So that's what you need to be put, putting down as you go. If you're aiming to, to move forward and to increase your living standards, you'll need to approach things in a slightly different way. And uh, now is the time to start thinking about either of those objectives and prioritizing the level that you want to achieve in each area of your life. So in your domestic area, your housing situation, your relationships with the people you're sharing your time with at home, uh, whether that's family or friends or flatmates or business relationships where you're, you're working from home. And you, you need to also look at your, your business relationships if you're working from an office or if you're in sales and you're on the road, you need to be looking at, at what you want to achieve from your business relationships for next year. Start thinking about that now. And then when the beginning of December arrives, start to put it down on paper in an official way. Make some notes in between. But when it comes to December the 1st, that's the time you need to be thinking about your goals for the following year. So you're doing everything a month in advance of the beginning of the process. And um, that's the way it works for me. It seems to work better if you prepare about a month or two, maybe two, sometimes two months ahead of time. Uh, so that's what I wanted to share with you today. And it's a tip for, for goal setting is be in advance of yourself all the time. Uh, that's it for me for now. If you've enjoyed the video, please subscribe to the channel. Uh, you can share this with your friends on Twitter or Facebook or stumble upon any of those types of places. Or you can leave me feedback underneath in the comments section of, uh, at YouTube or on, it, on the blog that you're watching the video on. Thanks again for, for your time and thanks for watching.